Dr. Hans Berendes. I'm Dr. Rutledge's anesthesiologist. We're in the operating room today, and I'm here with Dr. Kular from uh, Northern India. And he's here uh, taking a look at the anesthesia and reviewing the surgical procedure that Dr. Rutledge does, the mini gastric bypass. Uh, today we're doing a TIVA, which is total intravenous anesthesia technique for this patient who's having a mini gastric bypass. And we are using no anesthetic gases or no volatile agents uh, whatsoever. The patient is only receiving oxygen and controlled mechanical ventilation. We are using um, TIVA, which is a propofol, which is mixed with remifentanil. Remifentanil is a very fast-acting narcotic broken down by red blood cell esterases. We're also using ketamine and uh, Presidex, which are medications that increase respiratory rate for respiratory drive and decrease uh, the need for post-operative narcotics. They are considered narcotic sparing um, anesthetics and they are analgesics also. Uh, we limit uh, the dosage of narcotics given in the OR and also in the uh, uh, PACU or the post anesthesia care unit by approximately sevenfold. So patients wake up smoother, they have yeah, a good respiratory rate, usually a rate between 18 and 22, 24. Uh, we have no problems with sleep apnea or dealing with any associated complications um, regarding um, obesity and uh, sleep apnea. So right now we're taking a look at the monitor and I'm showing Dr. Kula our, our vital signs and how we're doing with uh, the total intravenous anesthetic. We're using a BIS monitor. And our BIS monitor we want to keep uh, less than 50. We have our propofol infusion pump, which is given the propofol and the remifentanil. Uh, we have a good IV that's working and uh, we're closely monitoring blood pressure, heart rate, and oxygen saturation. He's currently uh, on controlled ventilation, and uh, we're ventilating at a rate of uh, nine per minute, and he has a normal uh, CO2 level. And I think that concludes our, uh, our afternoon with uh, Dr. Rutledge and going over the uh, anesthetics for the mini gastric bypass. Thank you very much. Thank you.